to learn how to take photos from Lightroom and get them turned into Google Classroom for an assignment. A lot of times I'll request that you have maybe five to ten photos for most assignments. Um, so understand that you're doing multiple, um, you're adding multiple documents to the classroom post to turn things in. Most often it's going to be more than one document uh, in photography class. So I've made myself a student in our first hour digital photo. I'm going to, um, I'm on the mainstream of the uh, of our class. I'm going to go to class work. So you can see right now that's the only project that's due. It's some school spirit photos um, from Lightroom using Lightroom mobile on my phone and then uh, you were supposed to turn in photos that show school spirit. Now my photos are some family photos, so they're different, but I'm gonna show you how to attach those. So I'm gonna click on the project, and again, I'm the student, okay? Here's all the information. It tells me I need five photos using my mobile device from the Lightroom mobile app, um, and that it shows school spirit. I'm gonna turn these in, attaching um, all five to uh, this post. So I am going to view the assignment, and now I need to add the photos. So I'm gonna say add or create. Now I will tell you, actually let's click down here and let's see, always make sure that your photos that you wanna turn in are in Lightroom and ready to go. Uh, if they didn't show up from Lightroom uh, mobile onto the computer, onto the desktop in the room, uh, make sure your syncing is on. And my syncing is on and I'm currently synced. I just needed these five photos to show up and they're all there. So um, I'm actually going to take, I'm gonna click on that first one and you can see the white box around that photo it's selected. I'm gonna hold down shift and I'm gonna click on the last box. Now all five are selected. And then I'm going to go to file and export, okay? Um, there's other ways to do this, several ways, but that's how, that's one way. To me, that's easy. We're gonna hit export five photos and it's asking you, where do you want these photos to go? Well, I know it's hard to see right here because it's cut off, but I'm gonna click over in this space to move the, move the frame over. I'm looking for desktop. I just wanna put these on my desktop. Now notice I have a folder called desktop right here, but I don't want them in the folder. I just want them on my desktop, which is the colored background, okay? And you should do the same. So put them on your desk for now. You can always make a folder over here later and, and organize your photos. But for now, you want them to show up at five individually on the desktop. So I've got desktop selected, hit export. It's gonna take a second. And then now you can see we've got all five photos sitting over here ready to go. So I'm just gonna click off and deselect those. I'm gonna minimize my Lightroom. So again, the photos are coming from the Lightroom mobile app into Lightroom on your computer. You have uh, minimized this after I've gotten these over here to the desktop with an export. Remember that was file export, okay? And so up here, now it's time to turn them in. Now, in some assignments, you'll need to do photo editing using Photoshop, whatever. But in this assignment, it was not, there was no editing required. You just needed the five photos to show school spirit. So we're gonna click on add or create. We're gonna come down here to file. And then this is just super simple. Um, and I'm gonna even see, sometimes it'll let you do them all at once. So literally it opens up, it says upload, and you can browse or drag a file here. I'm clicking on my mouse, I'm gonna select all five of those, so they're all five highlighted at once, and I'm gonna click and drag, and I'm dropping all five of them at once. Okay, and I can see one, two, three, four, and now five, excuse me, one, two, three, four, and five have all uploaded. And so we're gonna see little, we should see little thumbnails of them over here. Um, so I've got all five of my images over here. If for some reason I had turned in the wrong photo, I could X here and remove one of these. Um, and you could, you could add more. I'm not quite sure. These are fairly high quality photos. I'm not, as far as resolution, I'm not sure how big of photos and how many a Google Classroom post will take, but I know it's at least 10 because I've had students do that before and maybe even as much as 20. Um, so you just add all your images here and then you're gonna mark this as turned in. Okay, and so, or that you want to turn those five in. It's gonna ask you, are you sure you wanna submit these five attachments? And you say, yes, yeah, so you're gonna turn those in. And it is not turned in until that's what you see. So you should see your five individual posts, your five individual um, photos in this case, and the unsubmit button, because that means I've submitted it. And if I wanted to undo that at this point, I would have to hit unsubmit. Um, <clears throat> and I would have to hit unsubmit 
just to unlock the assignment again if I had more photos that I wanted to add. Um, but hitting unsubmit, if you'll watch, it doesn't show, it doesn't remove those photos. Okay, they're still there, but it unlocks it so then I could X out of them if I wanted to take some off or that it's available now for me to add additional photos if I wanted to, okay? So again, I'm just gonna mark it as turned in. And again, it's gonna ask me to confirm that. And that's it. That's how you add photos from your mobile app on your phone in Lightroom to now syncing on Lightroom on the computer, exporting them to the desktop and uploading them to Google Classroom to turn them in for a grade. You need to follow all these steps to make sure that you get that done. Thank you for listening. Have a great day.